could think of one thing in the world that would make you feel better right now, what would it be? I wouldn't say no to a sloppy joke. Thank you. Mm. What the hell is this, Spencer? Uh, that, my friend, is gazpacho. It's very refreshing. Mm. All right, I'm gonna get him out of here. We're gonna be back at the station if you all need us. I'm oh, so sorry. Sorry, I tried to kill you with my sword, Guster. Sean, if Lloyd is now killer, then who else could it be? This guy's a serious klepto. I think he has one of Amy's paychecks. We need to get back in Lloyd's place. What? Why? Are you gonna explain to me what's going on, Sean? Yes, Gus, yes I am, and it is a doozy. We thought that Lloyd had stolen one of Amy's paychecks. But upon further inspection, it's not a paycheck. It's a bill. Two thirty-seven. Should have known. You don't work at the hospital, do you, Amy? We paid a little visit to a psychiatrist named Doctor Anktil. You're his patient. Too bad the doctor-patient confidentiality agreement is moot when he's suspected of murder. Yeah, he told us you have mommy issues and daddy issues, and something called acute rejection disorder. Probably has something to do with you being left at the altar twice. You fell madly in love with the first victim, Ray Brower, but the feelings just weren't mutual. So you used the folklore of Prospect Garden, stories of its haunting born by the murder-suicide committed by the building's architect, J. Michael Hageman, many years ago. I don't know what you're talking about. You methodically made Ray think he was losing his mind by haunting and drugging him, and eventually pushing him out of his own bedroom window. It worked so well that you decided to do the same thing again to Mark who also gave you the cold shoulder. That's not true. Uh, uh, uh. Still not finished, Bananas Foster, because there's poor, poor Lloyd. After all these years of kleptomania, his sticky fingers finally found evidence that you were up to some nasty, nasty business. So you killed him, and somehow figured out a way to stuff him into the world's largest industrial dryer and put him on a long cycle. The cops are on their way, Amy. This is the end of the line. Sorry. There's an amazing view. It's mostly trees. Good thing Lord replaced that on it. Yeah, I guess. She's crazy! She did it! <laughs> <laughs> 